We're out here with my client, Dolly Diaz, who just drove two hours to come share what we've accomplished over the last year working together. Getting the confidence back in lifting because it was such a big part of my life. Yeah. And then it wasn't. And then getting back to it. I remember when we started, you were just doing the body pump classes or something, right? I was doing the in-home weights that I had bought during COVID when I was doing the, the body pump classes. But then the starting the um, steps, yes. being accountable to the steps yep. was huge. Yep. It started becoming daily just moving more right like that was that was a super big one and then transitioning from those classes you were doing your steps more I remember distinctly you getting really excited you're like I think I'm ready and you were ready to go step into the actual gym floor you were ready to essentially like step into the the big kid uh, weight room right we started like okay and I remember I was like okay do we want to do machines you're like no I want I want the barbells so you were just like I want to go into the barbells I want to use some of the barbells we programmed you I think what do we start with squats and deadlifts right and it was just like very simple straightforward one or one or two exercises I remember getting your form videos back and you were killing it that was like a huge thing and uh, I remember you said, like you said, like that was a big part of your life back when you were training with the trainer and back when you were working with Brandon, right? And so from there, you know, we started creating more lifestyle habits. We started creating more habits in your lifestyle. Um, what other things uh, did you start noticing when you started uh, working out more inside the gym? Well, one of the things that was very helpful and beneficial to me is you asked me what my favorite lifts were. Mm. And because I, I'm not very good at front squats. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I will make you do none of that stuff. And, and so I told you, and so you implemented that, and it, it just felt safe because that was what was important, is to go in and know I could do what I do well. Yeah, the confidence. And speaking of confidence, you know, what's, what's another, like, amazing thing that I, I don't know about you but it's something i noticed huge um over this time almost almost a year together was your confidence and so could you share with me some of the the things that you've noticed about your confidence shifting and like what other things not only in the gym but even outside the gym like what are what are some of those things that signs that you were like oh wow i i really do notice a difference in my confidence yeah like when i for the longest time I was having to get those wide boots, and I just one day tried on these boots I had had in my closet, and they zipped up, and it was it was so amazing. There are so many amazing things that we've accomplished over this journey together over the last year or so, and uh, it's going to be really difficult to cover all of them. Um, but I would love for you to kind of highlight maybe the top three, the three most important, impactful things that we've accomplished that you've noticed change over our time working together. I do want to go over why I signed up with you. Okay. And, you know, I moved to Palm Springs, new city, new job, no friends. It, it, it was so overwhelming. Yeah. And I knew that I wanted to get back into my fitness journey. Mm -hmm. And we had never really met I used to watch you and I loved the way you were with your clients. I could tell you cared about them. I could tell, you know, they were just killing it. And when it came time, I followed you on Instagram and you had a, oh, like a raffle, like a- Oh, the, my giveaway. Yeah, yeah, giveaway. yeah. I was doing a scholarship, coaching scholarship. Yes. yes. And I was like, well, this is fake. This is fake. I like him. I know yeah. I like him. Yeah. And, um, you know, finding trainers is not as easy. My fears were they to rest when it came time for me to work on the machine. And I was like, oh, God, I don't know what I'm doing. I remember here. this. I said, can you FaceTime me? And you did. And it was so helpful because I was like, okay, now I know how to yeah. do it. And, and it gave me the no, a hundred percent. I remember that day and I remember you being, you telling me like, you're like, I'm very nervous to go into this area of the gym. It was all new to you. Never really used machines that much. And I remember you just saying like, Hey, I'm really nervous. I'm about to go use this. Boom. Hopped on the FaceTime and you walked over there with confidence. You used the machine. You knew how to use it. It was like, I, I, I remember just seeing the light bulb go off. Like, 
I got this. And that was, uh, that was a huge amount. Give me the freaking chills right here. Um, that was amazing, Dolly. And so uh, that is, that's a huge one. I love that. And I'm, I'm so, so extremely beyond happy that we connected from that scholarship and we're able to begin our journey together. And now a year into this, um, you know, what's, what's one of the other things, like what's one of the next most important things that has really been uh, impactful and kind of changed for you on this journey? So I wasn't sleeping at all. And I, once I started this journey and I started doing my steps, you know, in, in your app that, that you send to us, we record our steps, we record, you know, our food intake and mm -hmm. we record, you know, how we work out. And as I started going into this journey, my four to five hour night sleeps were turning into six to seven, even a couple of eight hours, which is yes. super rare. Literally doubled you how much sleep you get. And it was big sleep, it was deep. Yeah. Oh yeah. You track your sleep score and it was like, it went from like 40, 50% yeah. to like 90s, yeah. 80%. Like, it's just so amazing. It was just a huge difference yeah in my day and also i started to stop doing my twice or three times a week wine yeah it, it, just because you know how you feel in the morning and 100%. i wanted to feel good i knew i was going to work out the next day and that literally i was like okay let's stop monday through friday and i was just drinking on the weekends and even that 100 percent stopped to where you know i only drink when i go you know socially i've just completely stopped drinking yeah. by myself and how is this like almost doubling the amount of sleep you're getting how has this impacted your day-to-day -day life i just have a lot more energy and i just feel better and i see you smile a whole lot more oh. yeah look at that smile there it is okay so we talked about, you know, the major changes of your confidence in the gym, just being way more confident in the gym. Uh, we talked about how your sleep has probably been like one of the most dramatic changes that have completely changed your energy levels. So let's talk about maybe one more thing. I know we talked about like the amazing things that happen outside the gym. Now, like what's something inside the gym or maybe something physically that we've noticed change about you and, and who you are today? It's really hard to look at yourself and, and see but you know the other day I took pictures and I compared them from this month to last year yeah and um, on a whole and small it was very necessary for me to see absolutely so when we started and going into it I dropped almost 20 pounds wow and it was because I, it just, everything I was doing, to just everything I was feeling about the space I was in, it yeah. just, it just went away. You were literally a completely new version of yourself mentally, physically, and I remember like this amazing shift from, you know, when Dolly and I first started, when we first started, it was like this energy, um, I could tell it was just like, we were upset and we were frustrated with where we were as we've gone on longer and longer i just see you brightening up and like your happiness your confidence like i just see you smile a lot more when we do talk on the phone i remember we facetimed the other day and i could just literally feel the energy through the phone like you were just so much better of a place not just physically but more importantly mentally you're a whole new human you know tyler day to day life gets really super hard sometimes things we can't control but the thing about you being a coach is like in the literal, literal sense, when I get those weekly check-ins from you and I'm feeling super frustrated about whatever's going on, yeah. just your positive, positivity um, as a coach and as my very own cheer, cheerleader um, is huge. It, it, I look forward to it. It makes me feel like, okay, okay, you've got this, you've got this. Whatever's going on, you've got this. And, then, and you know, you can't ask for much more. That means the absolute world to me, Dolly. Thank you so much. And, um, you know, one of the last things I want to say is, like, you know, if there's someone out there that is on the fence right now, they're really considering, you know, potentially working with us, or they're like, I don't know, you know, what I need or what coach I need or who I want to work with, like, what would you say to that person if they're kind of, considering potentially working with us in TNT uh, online or in person. However hard
hard you think it is to start this fitness journey for yourself, it's it's harder not to. I believe in this. As long as you are honest with yourself and tell you what's going on, there's no end to what you can do being a part of this team. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm proof. I, I was, you know, the heaviest I had ever been. I was just really not doing well and you know in a year I'm just so much better than if I never would have started it so I would say just you have nothing to lose and everything to gain I love that dog well I seriously you have no idea I really really appreciate you driving over two hours to come out here and uh, it means the world to me and so thank you again and uh, it's been an absolute pleasure working with you bring it in here.